share the reasons why we chose to use 100% weed barrier in our operation and also footage from receiving our shipments to start planting in 2021. Using weed barrier can be a very controversial topic, even between us. Originally, I was not for it. As an artist, I really enjoy the aesthetic of the purple with the green grass between the rows. We took our time making this decision, weighing the pros and cons, and realizing what was best for us. First, we considered our farm's soil types. Where we're situated, our soil is very well draining, which is a prerequisite for using weed barrier. A few of our main factors in our decision were the fuel wear and tear on the machinery, and the time in order to maintain our fields. So one of the cons for using weed barrier is that it is made of plastic. Which, however, when we were reflecting on not using it, we would still need to use non-renewable resources such as gas and time to maintain the field and whatever grew between the rows. So we ultimately decided that it was in our best interest to use 100% ground cover. With the way the economy has been in the past few years and the price of fuels, we were very happy with our decision to invest in weed barrier. And another perk is the amount of time and energy we have saved on our bodies and equipment with doing so. Here's some footage from receiving our shipments of ground cover to begin our 2021 planting season. Thank you.